Hello, I'm Dr. David Cathcart. I'm a family practice physician from Heartland Regional Medical Center in St. Joseph, and we're going to talk about uh, chemotherapy drugs and their side effects today. Uh, chemotherapy for stomach cancer can be given in the form of injections or perhaps through an IV or even pills. Sometimes chemotherapy for stomach cancer particularly is given before uh, surgery to remove the tumor or even after surgery. Many times uh, uh, with stomach cancer, uh, the best option is to try and reduce symptoms rather than try to completely kill the cancer. The drugs are given um, to in, in such a way as to try and shrink the tumor down to make passage through the uh, passage of food through the stomach a little easier. Unfortunately, like all other chemotherapy drugs, they have side effects, and the side effects again can be hair loss, weight loss, it can, and it can cause nausea, and since that's one of the things we're trying to avoid with stomach cancer, uh, we have to deal with that, and, and uh, it's often dealt with by reducing the dose or giving other medications that might help reduce the, the, uh, the nausea that comes along with chemotherapy. Uh, but in any event, uh, the, the side effects are the same. You can get uh, sores inside your mouth. If you're a woman, you may get sores inside your vagina because, again, these cells are the ones that are rapidly uh, dividing. And, the, again, as you may have re recall from an earlier segment, cancer chemotherapy drugs kill cancer cells because they're rapidly dividing. Any cell that's rapidly dividing, like, for example, in the mouth, or the hair or the cells inside the vagina are also rapidly dividing, so you're liable to get sores in those areas or, or hair loss. So, this is Dr. Cathcart uh, talking to you about uh, chemotherapy for stomach cancer.